Hello my charmed ones and welcome back to my channel for another video. Today I have something fun for you, a planner personality test to determine what your planner style says about you. Specifically, today I'm going to evaluate the four most common planner closure styles and what it reflects about your personality if you use each. Now I realize most of us within the planner community have used different closure styles in the past, I, for one, have dabbled in planners with each of these closure methods, but I think there might be one or maybe two types of planner closures that we're drawn to above all others. So as you go through this personality test and evaluate which style works for you, think about which of the closure styles you are most drawn to, and that should help you zero in on your personality type. Of course, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, share the video with your planner besties, and of course, leave me a comment down below to let me know your planner style and if the personality test was accurate for you. I'm so curious to see how many people this actually applies to. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump in. First, let's begin with the zip around planner style. If you're drawn to this style of planner, you're likely a very cautious and even secretive person. You are likely not a very showy person, you're much more reserved, you might be prone to anxiousness, and you might be something of a worst case scenario sort of planner, a little bit of a worry ward. Planners who use this style closure are likely to enjoy a small but close circle of friends and are not risk takers. So does that sound like you? Are you someone drawn to the zip around planner style? Let me know in the comments. Next, let's dissect the button closure planner style. If you're drawn to this style of planner, you're likely a very buttoned up and professional type of person on the outside at least. You're likely a networker at heart with a busy schedule always making moves in your social and professional life. You like action and activity. You're drawn to people and likely have a varied network of friends and acquaintances. Although you might like to present yourself as a polished pro, you certainly have a wild or mischievous side, however, that you aren't afraid to let slip out every once in a while. So is that you? Are you a button closure planner style? Let me know in the comments. Next, we have the string or elastic closure planner style. Planners drawn to this style are very flexible people who are also extremely creative. You are not afraid of a change of plans and you like to go with the flow. You have lots of big ideas and aren't afraid to bring them to fruition. Although it must be said that you have a tendency to start more projects than you actually finish. But you have a lot going on in your mind. Sometimes things may be a little cluttered in there, but you are the type of person who absolutely always finds some way to work things out and fit things in. You likely have a modest but extremely tight-knit circle of friends and family who consider you their number one cheerleader and greatest supporter. So are you an elastic closure type of person, a string-bound person? Let me know down in the comments. And finally, we come to the book style planner or planners without a closure. If you're one of the planners drawn to this style, you're likely a very easygoing and carefree personality. You don't like limits, boundaries, or rules. In fact, you're always trying to push the envelope when it comes to those things. You might have a rebellious spirit, but you always have your heart in the right place. Although you might normally be highly organized, you do sometimes have a tendency to bite off a little more than you can chew, but you always find a way to manage things without a meltdown. You may have a great circle of friends, but often prefer to spend time alone in thought or in self-care. So is that you? Are you a book style or a planner without a closure? So which of the four planner styles are you drawn to and do you agree or disagree with this personality typing? Let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear what you thought about this. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Feel free to share it with your planner besties and be sure to follow me on Instagram at Miss Trenchcoat for more of the behind the scenes of my productivity life and business. And if you're not yet subscribed to this channel, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button for more awesome videos by me. And until next time, bye bye